So I'm very happy to uh, come here and talk at the GDIS uh, conference. Uh, I have always been uh, very interested in blockchain. I think uh, when you uh, look back uh, in uh, today's era, uh, from uh, <coughs> much into the future, uh, we will understand that this is uh, one of the key innovations of uh, humanity. Basically, we found a natural me mechanism to reach consensus in a de decentralized and distributed way. So I always uh, think about the history of the world as an oscillation between centralization and decentralization and uh, early on for example you have centralized monopolies such as ATT which uh, practically monopolized all the networking resources and then through TCPIP which is a decentralized protocol uh, this monopoly uh, uh, disappeared uh, but then the content gets very spread uh, into the uh, internet and some centralized monopoly uh, occur again uh, and in those centralized platforms they try to organize the information better but uh, the problem that arises is that the, our own private data gets owned in centralized platform, and that's not the way it should be. So all the private data should be maintained at own, our, our own private uh, protected device. Uh, the problem then is that there's a little value if you keep it completely to yourself. There's no mechanism for a marketplace to take place. So the title of my talk is called In Math We Trust. There are those mathematical primitives which makes it possible to do privacy-preserving computation, data computations. So we completely uh, maintain the privacy of our own individual data, but still making uh, collective uh, statistical learning possible. And this is a really uh, exciting new world and will change every aspect of our life. I think uh, the blockchain will develop just like life on Earth developed. Uh, there will not be just one kind of life. There are many, many species, and it's an evolutionary process. Uh, so is blockchain. Uh, so is anything else that has life. Uh, so you can think of blockchain as a form of life. And it will evolve and bifurcate and will merge uh, and all these natural uh, activities, ecological activities will also happen uh, on blockchain. So certainly in the infrastructure layer, we need to find a way to scale uh, the blockchain network to much faster, uh, very much like Lightning Networks. Uh, we're also incubating projects which along this direction, uh, which will make uh, the whole blockchain much faster. Uh, I also believe that uh, the privacy-preserving uh, data marketplace uh, is the killer app of uh, blockchain, and was not only systematically investing, but also systematically incubating.